Welcome back to Instagram Play Super Smash Brothers Melee, featuring myself, Spencer, and my co-host Matt. I'm playing as Sheik, Matt's playing as Falco. We heard that one just TV slash Neo Game GameTV. Midway through, we're doing a best of five with some slippy stats. That'll do it. How many fucking um uh, uh needles does she have? Like eight? Uh I don't know. It's not ultimate. while Matt calibrates.
Yeah. No oh, fuck, dude. I'm not playing this fucking stage. Hate that stage. This stage I like. Fastball. in air or something. The wall up, yeah. I know. You I can't know. wall I ride. I know. I can't wall ride it. I know. Ah, it's it it's doesn't look like you know. It's like... I could have fucking um, wait against them, I'm sure.
I can't move. That was obvious. <clears throat> the problem is I'm not thinking about Falco. Think about Final Fantasy 15. That works on Cheek the way it works on Mark. I think Cheek is definitely a little bit faster in the air. I can't. I'm not 100% sure of that. Talking about the launch distance. Oh, I see. The spacey thing you wouldn't understand. <laughs> Bubble theory. Hmm. Hate to have that fucking windmill installed. Yeah. Although I told the contractor to not put that fucking wooden uh, little bridge in there. Told him it'd be a problem. Did he listen? No. He's like, oh, you need something to go over the water. I'm like, fuck it, we'll walk through the water. Best of five. First game, Dreamland. Okay, you waited way too long. You're not allowed to scream like that. Like, like, okay, count to three. All right. When? What's up, corn? Hey, how's it going, corn? Oh, churchy church. Oh.
why did I do that? Like I knew, I knew you were there. He's doing? I'm uh, doing okay. First game in the best of five. All right, second game. I think. Uh, God. Um. I guess Battlefield. Ready. Try to go down to the ledge. Where I would be and Shroom didn't make a bracket. Yeah, we were watching yesterday. Shroom just had to take two games. Oh my god, that's not... is projected to go to loser's bracket. Is it that? 3 on Mango, yeah. Oh my god, no. No. bit forward smashes why i'm not trying to forward smash I'm not sure if i'm a big fan of the swiss pool thing i think the swiss pool thing is is cool i think yeah. it, if it's laid out much clearer i think it could be much cooler some people are making jokes in the chat it's like oh smash players uh experiencing swiss pool for the first time we've had swiss pools in the past but that makes me think that, that a lot of other competitive things do swiss is more of like a like a common thing but I, I like it. I mean, basically, exactly what 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 uh, what Hungerbox said. It's it's really it's it's a pretty good thing for like viewers. Like it 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 uh it makes everything every, every game like feels really important, you know. 
But it is kind of interesting that like one game could affect the outcome of other players that aren't even involved in the game or that were set. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's the problem. I think like, if, it's, crazy. if it's better communicated to everybody, the players and stuff like that. Yeah. Like when Mango was like, if I had known that this was going to happen, if I lost. Well, I they're playing in a real bracket right now, Corn. You dumb fucker. Yeah. They did the Swiss to get to to decide who's in losers, who's in winners, and who isn't in at all. And then now they're doing a real bracket. Everyone, bitch. <laughs> all right, pick a stage. Yeah. Um, so I can 3-0 you and be done with this. <sighs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> uh, Yoshi's story. Two people didn't get in. Yeah, because they lost the most. Don't fucking lose. I wouldn't have lost. I'm just kidding. I would have got destroyed. If there's any player that you could play against that you think you would definitely win in in the summit bracket right now, who would you pick, Matt? Uh, probably Magi. I don't know, dude. She's pretty good. I mean, she's good. That's the... I didn't... I mean... Yeah, that's, that's, that's just the person you... Like, out of everyone else, right? Yeah, there are no Samuses. I could probably... With all my Samus practice, I feel like I could give Hugs a run for his money. Especially since he doesn't he, he doesn't go for the same things I don't go for as well. <laughs> I think that you could probably do pretty well against like Percent. No, he's really good. Who would you get, Spencer? Who would I play against? Um, I have no fucking clue, dude. I don't think I could beat any of them. Um, it'd have to be a fox, because I feel like I'd have the highest ch chance against a fox rather than, like, a falco. No, actually, if I played Samus versus... Come on, it's the last game, dude. Thank you. Sometimes dolphin listens. Well, likes to fuck, like just like fuck shit up. I, yeah, I, th I think if I if I had a chance to play Samus versus like a Falco, even though I lose against Matt's Falco all the time, he's just he just knows my shit. But anytime I've ever played against a a, a Falco on um, net play, granted that's not a good representation of all uh, of the Falcos at Summit. I destroy him. Yeah, so, but like out of the Falcos, there's what? Magi and Bobby Mango? Big Balls, Mango. Oh, Bobby Big Balls. God, I have no idea, dude. I think I was just losing against everybody. Um, Yeah, that would be. I still think I'd have the. I, probably the player that I might have the best uh, uh, chance with is the same one that you'd have the best chance with, I think. Bobby Big Balls is combo crazy, though. Yeah, you might be able to just, like, if you weather the storm, I think you can win. Not you, but people. You as in, like, yeah. Not directed at someone specific. Um, okay, so uh, best of five. Game one. Uh, Dreamland, two minutes and 19 seconds. I took two stocks. Matt, you rolled twice. Air dodge four times. Spot dodge once. I did the old one one zero. Your neutral ends, 12 to my two. I had two neutral ends, but, I mean, you had seven counterheads and I had nine. And we had both, both have one beneficial trade, so I didn't have the advantage at all. <laughs> um, I was gonna say, but Sheik Spark specifically. Really? Yeah. No, I would get destroyed by Spark. I would get destroyed by any Sheik. I feel like I just crumble under Sheik. Yeah. I just have a hard time against Sheik. I don't know why. Um. Uh, well. Yeah. As Marth, I don't know. I actually don't know about Samus. 
That's good corn. Um, let's see here. Your inputs were 329, mine were 282. Let's go down. Okay, with a down tilt, a down air, a down air, and a forward smash. I could do a forward air and a neutral beat. Oh, I needled you. Right. Um, you had a 46% combo, my, followed by a 36% combo on my first stock. I had a 40% combo on your first stock. You had a 44% combo hold on. on my second stock, a 46% combo on my third, and a 46% followed by a 37% combo on my last stock. Second game. Uh, battlefield, 2 minutes and 45 seconds. I took one stock. Not so great. You rolled twice, I rolled twice, but I was once. I didn't do any of those things. Uh, you had 16 initial wins, I had 5. You had 10 counter hits, I had 14. And I and I had one beneficial trade. Are you talking about the uh, the smash turnaround back air? Corn? The walk turnaround back air thing is such a good mix-up. Yeah. Pretty sick. You do that. Sometimes. Um, your inputs per unit were 307, mine were 317. Hello. You came with a back air, a down air, a forward smash, and a neutral air. I killed you with a forward air. I had a 50% followed by a 48% combo on your first stock. You had a 51% combo on my second stock. Then you had a 44 followed by a 55% combo on my last stock. Yoshi's story. Two minutes and 35 seconds. Last game, I took two stocks. You rolled three times, but dodged once. I just uh, rolled twice and air dodged five times. Um, you had eight neutral ones. I had nine. Oh my god, I had more neutral ones. Didn't matter. Uh, you had five counter hits. I had ten. Oh, look. Oh, same thing. And you had one beneficial hit. I had none. Um, you get fucked, idiot. Yeah. Oh, so, well, me, I'm, me dummy. Um, we both have the same amount of dash chances at nine. You don't get to see Spence's sheet that much. Does he tech chase? He tries. I try. Does he utilize needles sometimes? I mean, this is like... Like, I took a huge sabbatical from Sheik. Like a year-long one. Yeah. So. And even then, you weren't playing her regularly. Yeah. Um, Let's see here. Inputs, 325 for you, 339 for me. Don't know why it's so high. Uh, You kill me with an up air, a down air, a down tilt, and a forward smash. And I killed you with a forward air, and you killed yourself at 8%. You had a 36% combo followed by a 57% combo on my first stock. I had a 37% combo on your first stock. Then you had a 103% combo on my third stock and a 94% combo on my last stock. Oh, baby. There's a, a couple of good stocks there at the end. Zero to death. Yeah. Uh, you guys saw that Mango versus Plup, right? How do you think Mango did? I think Mango did very poorly. I think Mango didn't realize the ramifications of what he was choosing to do and uh went falco the whole time and didn't take him to fd they didn't realize that it was gonna ha you, you know it was gonna change the stuff yeah like i said the, the swiss pool kind of fucked him yeah but it's actually he... crazy on fd but he always goes fox now most of the time All right. Um, any particular thoughts? I mean, how you? I mean, I played really bad. Yeah, I, um, I figured you might say that. Which sucks because I had such a good first episode of Fox. Very good shit. Yeah, I was hopeful that maybe like Plain Chic would would offer some variety in a way that would at least like tickle your brain a bit. It's like. Doing something different, but not completely different. You know what I mean? Um, yeah. But, uh, I mean, how do you feel about, uh, I don't know, that, that matchup? I think you played it better than last week, but I also played really bad, so it was hard to tell. Hmm. I did get some... And you had, like, so many sick board smashes. Oh, my dude. God, dude. So, so many, So many dude. really cool ones. Just fucking... Forward smashes. Forward dude. smash master. Just like that's oh, what man. they call you on the streets. Dude, I was so good at forward smash. I had three in like a 10 second time period. Uh -huh. One on the ground, one on the side platform, and one on the top platform. I'm telling you. Right? Just forward smash. Mix forward up, smash, mix forward. up, mix up. And you never knew what was happening. One of the times it even helped me. Yeah. When I forward smashed you at the ledge and they got the forward air. <laughs> you know the thing I want to do in the first place. I mean, no, forward smash, dude. Forward smash all the way. Uh, disrespect. Yeah, that's what it was. Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, I feel like I played okay. Uh, 
you know, I, I, I didn't play like a uh, sheep player fully, you know, I'm like, I'm like in perfect cell, you know what I mean? But like all the time, I never get to perfect cell. I'm always in perfect cell, right? Which sucks because I have a shitty voice um, and I look ugly as yeah. in perfect cell. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Definitely not in real life. No, of course not. But beautiful in real life. Uh, name for the episode, I'm done. I got you. Uh, name for the episode, uh, Imperfect Sheep. Usually sheep. I would try to keep going, but if Falco played better, I would have kept going. I got you. Also, there's like Summit and shit, you know? It's like, yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, Imperfect Sheik is that name. All right. That sounds fine. So we're going to go ahead and call it a stream. Thanks, Corn, for coming in for the last bit here, talking to us about Sheik and Summit and all that good stuff. Um, but uh, we're going to go ahead and call it a stream. For those of you on YouTube, check us out live on twitch.tv slash TV, and we'll see everybody next time. Peace.